Wayne Elementary students got a chance to experience how to operate an Iditarod sled and how to learn communication and cooperation. Mike Jackson, a second grade teacher at Wayne Elementary, has been following the Iditarod with his classes for over 25 years and enjoys giving the students a lesson while allowing them to have fun at the same time. The kids have a blast with this and they're, they're learning so much, they're, they're using their cooperation skills to get along to decide who's, who's going to be the musher next and who gets to be the rider and, and so they're using all the things that we teach them in the classroom uh, out in real life on the playground. The students follow the Iditarod from the beginning, the first Sunday in March, to its end, which normally takes about two weeks. The children are put into groups of four to five, and they follow a single musher all the way through the race. Jackson uses this information in the classroom by incorporating the race with their language arts, verbs, and adjectives in the students' writing. The students have an opportunity to learn about their musher and keep track of the miles the musher has gone and how much they have left to go. The students follow the position of their musher by watching videos from the racer. Rachel Walker and Taya Beller, volleyball players at Wayne State, join the students during their lesson on moving and pulling the sled. Walker has done clinical hours at Wayne Elementary before with Jackson. Jackson was happy to see the kids participate with Walker. Rachel's been in my room a few times this year doing some clinical hours and the kids really love her. Um, they're always excited when she can come back and to have her come out and participate with us just kind of as a, as a person as a, rather than a teacher, it's fun for her to come out. She loves the kids and the kids love her a lot. So just more, more relationship building. The sled Jackson uses was built by Jewel Shock, a former zoologist at Wayne State College. When he moved away to Colorado, Shock donated the sled to Jackson to use for his students. Jackson is excited for the race to start in a month and is happy his students got a chance to learn about how a sled works. The idea is to just to get the kids uh, familiar with the sled. When we watch the race coming up in about a month and a half or so, they're going to understand what it's like to be a musher on a sled. So they, they've been on it, they've ridden on it, they've pulled it, they see the mushers on the videos, they understand what it's like going up hills and down hills and what it's like to pull a sled and everything that goes into just having fun on a dog sled. Despite the snow and slippery conditions, Jackson was able to convince me to get on and take the sled for a ride. Reporting in Wayne, this is Luke Stara, WayneDailyNews.com.